welcome back to my channel. I'm going to do a very quick beauty haul. It is inspired by YouTube gurus that I follow and am inspired by. And I'm going to call it YouTube inspired beauty haul. I know, whatever. So I hope you guys are having a great Sunday and I am going to jump right in. So I went to Harmon's yesterday, which is a good thing and a bad thing. Harmon's is a store in the city that has things that are more, you know, cost effective for the average girl. So as I was there, I, you know, make a mental list of all the things that my favorite gurus have loved. And so I picked some up. So I'm going to go ahead and let you know some of those things. So I'm going to kind of group them by guru, I guess. So let's start with one of my absolute favorite, favorite gurus. Her name is Emily Noel. She has several channels. She does, you know, really quick reviews. She's amazing. She's beautiful. She does great tutorials. She is just fantastic. So if you haven't seen her, I'll link her um, YouTube down below and check her out. Let her know I sent you. Not that she knows who I am, but still, it'd be nice to let her know. Um, product reviews. Even her husband does reviews now on men's products. It's awesome. So to jump right in, I this is from not from Harmons, but you'll see it. It comes together. So I got these Becca Glow to Go Portable Shimmering Skin Perfectors. They're three colors. Colors are opal, pearl, and champagne gold. So this is opal, this is pearl, and this is champagne gold. Let me do a quick swatch of all of them for you, really quick. So this is what they look like. They're really, really beautiful. Um, and that brings me to this e.l.f. small stipple brush, which is three dollars, which you can pick up wherever they sell e.l.f. And it's flat, it's dual fiber, and why I picked this up is because she uses it a lot for highlighting. She'll do a lot of highlighter there. Um, and it's on with these. Um, I put them on with my fingers, but I will try it her way the next time I wear it. Um, this is really amazing. I do think it's worth the money. I really like them. So those are the two things inspired by Emily Noel. Okay, the next person is Gabriella. I found Gabriella a while ago, and then she became good friends with Zoella. I don't know if anyone knows Zoella. If you don't, you have to know her, because she is fabulous. Gabriella inspired me to get this brush here. Um, it's the Real Techniques Expert Face Brush. It is $8.89 at Harman's, and what's awesome about it is they are a brush line created by Sam and Nick, who are YouTube beauty gurus. That's how they started. Um, so she uses this for foundation. I usually use, again, my fingers for foundation. You see a theme here. I'm trying to get into using, you know, not utensils, but you know what I'm saying, like brushes to put my stuff on. See if I like it. So this she uses as her foundation brush. So I'm gonna give that a try. I will let you know once I use it. Um, the next thing inspired by Gabriella, I'm actually wearing on my lips right now. I'll put a little more on. And this is the Sexy Mother Pucker Gloss Stick in the color Nudist. Looks like this. I have actually been wearing this. I do really like it. It doesn't seem like much and it's kind of pricey, it was $18, but it's really moisturizing. It gives your lips a really good shine. It's a great brand. I believe it's by Soap and Glory. Yes, Soap and Glory. And I got this at Sephora. So, boom, Gabriella. I think I just love accents because Gabriella has an accent and this next one coming up, Sharon Farrell has an accent. She is from Australia, I believe. She's fantastic as well. She's a redhead, she's funny, she's she's a makeup artist, so she knows her stuff. Um, so this is the Clump Crusher by CoverGirl. And I got the waterproof version just because I have oily eyelids and I usually use waterproof mascara if I'm not wearing my blink mascara. 
So this was $6.79. Um, I got the very black shade. This is like her holy grail, as they say, product, mascara. And it is by Lash Blast CoverGirl. So I'm gonna give that a try. Again, a kind of blanketed YouTube-inspired purchase where these are Dow. I got the Demi Wispies. They're really pretty. So as I've said in previous videos, I don't really know how to put on lashes. I've done it before and they're like too long and then my eyelid is like this and I'm like trying to see and take a picture and it's just, it's not attractive. <laughs> um, but I am going to do a video where I am taking tips that I've learned and trying to perfect putting on eyelashes with you guys and you guys can see me doing it in the process of learning. Um, it's by Milani, which is an affordable brand. I got the color Bella Cappuccino. Pretty, um, kind of like a satin taupe. Um, this was $3.99. I really like the packaging. It's gold and pretty easy to open. And you can see they kind of, like it dips in. Hmm. Um, some stuff I picked up was the Sesh Meat. It is my all-time favorite um, top coat. It does have, you know, warning on it that is horrible. It's like, can cause birth defects or other reproductive harm, which is scary. But I have read reviews on it where they've contacted the company and not that harmful they just have to put it on there so that's on there best top coat in my book um, I also picked up some more uh, makeup remover cleansing towels because who doesn't need more cleansing towels the Neutrogena ones are my favorite they don't feel oily or gross um, I really like them these were like four or something there um, I also I mainly just use skin to mint. I use whatever is cheaper, if I'm gonna be honest. Um, nighttime protective ointment. I have dry eye, so I actually have to sleep with ointment in. This is preservative free. Um, just pop a little bit in, that's how I sleep. So if you have dry eye, try sleeping with this. It might help you. Also sleep with your head elevated, that sometimes helps too. Um, got some hair removal strips. Do I really need to say what these are for? Sometimes you need some hair removal strips for your face. That's all I'm saying. Um, these were $7.49. I always use this brand, Gigi or Gigi. Um, back in the day, I tried multiple brands. This is the one that was the best for me. So that was all my stuff from my little haul recently. I'm gonna do some reviews on things. And sorry if this seems a bit rushed, um, filmed while I still had lights, as you know, my lighting situation. One day, I'm going to purchase some lights and then I can film whenever I feel inspired, which is a lot of times at night. Again, thank you so much for watching. I will do reviews on the stuff that I purchased so that you can know. It's been freezing here in New York to the point, like, I love seasons, but even I the other day was like, okay, I'm over the cold, thanks. Like I walk to work in like nine degree weather. I can't, but on an upswing, my heater is fixed. You wanna see my heater? Pink. My heater is fixed. I had no heat New Year's Eve. It was an ice box literally in my room. So that's positive. So anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this haul. I love watching hauls. It's like, what did you buy? I want to know why. Um, and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.